welcome to another art class. I hope you all had an exciting time last week drawing different objects using what I taught you, the different parts of a drawing. Do we still remember the different parts of a drawing? Okay, so tell me one part of a drawing that you remember. Great, that is very, very good. What part of your drawing is the foreground? Is it at the top or at the bottom of your drawing? Good, at the bottom of your drawing, after the line. What part of your drawing is the background? Yes, the background is the part of the drawing that is above the line or on top of the drawing all other objects that goes to the top is the background while the objects from the line down to the bottom is the foreground good so we remember very very well our topic for this week is creating objects with shapes creating objects with shapes i believe we all know how to create different objects with shapes we've been doing that in class ever since but this time, we're going to be learning how to create a truck. That's a vehicle or a car that carries goods, carries many load. That's what a truck is. So as usual, you know our class is always practical. And you're going to need different materials. Some of the materials you're going to need are a pencil, ruler, scissors, Glue, remember the white glue that we always use, which is top bond. That's what you need, okay? And we also need embossed paper. Different colors of embossed papers, like this. You can get different colors. I believe you may not have them right now as I'm talking to you, but not to worry. You can go through this video. After this, you can tell mommy to help you get embossed papers the other materials may be around in the house but if you do not have embossed paper right now do not worry so how do we create a truck using shapes i'm going to take you through the process now so follow me as we go and learn together to make the truck you're going to need embossed papers of different colors scissors ruler and pencil we're going to use our glue for later we'll be using the rectangle shape square shape and circle shape to create the truck to start get your embossed paper any color you like you can use that and your ruler and your pencil first thing we're going to do is mark out the size of the body of the truck which is going to be a rectangle shape and we are using 20 centimeters we're going to use 20 centimeters by 15 centimeters to mark it out start with the first line on your ruler on the centimeter side make sure it aligns with the edge of your paper and mark it out here on the 20 centimeter end you go to the bottom and do the same thing if your ruler is longer than your paper you can come straight to the bottom if your paper is longer than your ruler then you need to mark out at this middle point before marking out at the bottom my ruler is longer so i'm going to mark at the bottom 20 centimeters here after doing that join the two lines together by placing your ruler touching each of the marks that you have drawn and join them together with a straight line like this that's our 20 cm now we are going to measure out our 15 cm by turning the paper you need to turn it to get your 15 centimeters so you start again at the edge place the beginning of your ruler on the edge of the paper and mark out 
15 centimeters. Do the same thing at the bottom, 15 centimeters. And rule it out the same way you did for the first one. So here we have our 20 by 15 centimeters. When you're true, cut it out. So here is our rectangle. The next step is to cut out the square shape. You can do that using another color of embossed paper. Like we did for the first one, mark out your square shape using 10 centimeters. On this side, go to the bottom, do the same thing, 10 centimeters, and join the two marks together with a line. Turn to get the other side, which is 10 centimeters also. So here, mark out 10 centimeters, go to the bottom, and mark out another 10 centimeters. Join the two lines or the two marks together. So here we have our little square. When you're true, cut it out. The rectangle is going to be the body of the truck, while the square is going to be the front of the truck. So here you go. It's taking shape now, isn't it? Okay, so let's continue with the next step, which is the tires. We are going to need circles to make the tire. We're going to use two different sizes, a big circle and a small circle. We're going to need two big circles and two small circles. Get an object that is round, that has a circle shape, and place it at the middle of your paper. Press down and draw around it. There. There you have your circle. Cut it out. Remember, we need two circles, so we are going to cut out another one. Here it goes. Remember, I said we are going to need two different sizes, so I have cut out the big one. I'm going to draw out my small circle now. Place your circle up on your paper and, as usual, draw around it and cut it out. There you go. Remember that we need two of these, so you are going to draw out another one and cut it out. So here our materials are all ready. It's time to create the truck. First thing you need to do is join the square shape to the rectangle shape. And what do we use to join? Glue, correct. So here's my glue now. All you need to do is take your square shape and apply your glue to the edge, just a little bit on the edge. There you go. Okay. Now we're going to now we're going to place it also on the edge of the rectangle shape, making sure that it starts at the bottom here. It touches the bottom. It shouldn't go up like this. There shouldn't be any space left. So you start at the beginning and press down. Great. Do you see that? And turn back to the other side. Now it's time to fix the tires of the truck. And what shape are we using to fix the tires? Good. The circle shapes. So here are my circle shapes. To apply the tires, come to this part where you joined the rectangle and the square together. At the bottom, apply a little bit of glue and stick it down.
Go to the other side a little way in. Make sure that there is enough space and apply glue. Stick it down. Good. Our truck is coming up, isn't it? Beautiful. The last step is to add wheels to the middle of the tires. And this is what you do. Apply glue behind your small circle and stick it down at the center or at the middle of your big circle. Rub it down very well. Make sure it sticks very well. Do the same thing for the other side. And the truck is done. So we can go wherever we want to go. Who wants to take a ride with me? Who wants to take a ride with Tisha Taino? Let's go. Let's go. Vroom. Oh, I wish I could be with you right now to see what you're going to be making. But you know, Teacher Tenu cannot be with you. So I believe you're going to follow these steps closely. One after the other, like I showed you just now. And create your truck. Wow, I hope you had fun learning about how to create a truck. Good. Teacher Tenu is very, very eager to see your work. After you finish, take a picture of it as usual. I always tell you, I love to see your work. Send it down to me in the comment section at the bottom of this video. And let me know what you have done. I'm going to see it and mark it for you. I'll give you some time now to start working on your own. <music> I really had a wonderful time with you today. Next week, we are going to create another object using shapes. I hope you're looking forward to it as much as I am. Good. We are going to see again next week. Bye-bye.